What's up, guys? We're back. And time for some Denver solo challenges. Now, it's a good thing we're moving fast through these because I have 10 hours to play this. And I gotta make things go fast. Um, I'm, like I said, I'm not gonna be broadcasting to you guys every little thing I do. But these solos we can go through. Pack openings, of course, as always. Hello, viewer. I'm assuming you're returning from the last video. So, yeah, guys, I'm going to do skills trainer, and I'm going to save all the skills trainer packs, and we'll open those. But, yeah, I'm going to be playing a lot of Madden today. Um, probably all my 10 hours, really, because I'm busy this weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Monday, I'm probably busy during the day, but I'm getting the game on Monday at midnight, and I'll be broadcasting through midnight to the morning. So, yeah, um, probably a lot of Madden videos going up today, or a lot being recorded, at least. So yeah, let's get into the Denver wave of challenges. Gain 20 or more rush yards. That's what we got to do. Let's get into this. Alright, so basically all we got to do is run for 20 yards. Very simple challenge. As you can see, all last year, the situationals, journeys, whatever you want to call them, mad moments, I don't care. The whole thing was you had to beat them. They'll just throw you in different situations, but you have to beat them in the end. In this one... We don't have to do, we don't have to beat people. Right now, all we're doing is rushing. The next one is passing. So we don't have to beat the Broncos in this solo challenge, which is really cool. And there's Arian Foster, who's going to get the first. And see, every time you do something, your goals are updated. Now we're 10 out of 20. And getting a 76 Arian Foster, I believe he was my pro pack pull, first pro pack, of course, is a good thing. We'll take that. It's almost a tendency breaker. <laughs> and uh, about nine, I'm going to say. Eight, eight yards, we need two more to wrap up this solo challenge. This is awesome. I love this. Everything about this. I can see how much they improved. And there it... Oh, actually, that's probably not enough. Is it? There we go. So I really just love how they changed it up. They replaced your MVP sets and your captain sets. With monthly team heroes. So, basically with that, you need to get 5 gold, 10 silver, 10 bronze from whatever team you want to go for. And you can get their team hero. Now, I'm going to try to get the Giants team hero every single month. And maybe do an all Giants team at the end of Madden 17. But, end of Madden 17. We're thinking in the future. This game hasn't even come out yet. So, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Opening games pack once again. Okay, I will take Leonard Hankerson. That will actually help us. So let's go to teams and we'll update that, all right? Let's change that up. Now, was that a new wave of solo challenge that I see? In the beginning, I am going to... Oh, continue, as they did last year. So basically, guys, we're going to be doing a lot of the solos. And if you can't get EA Early Access, obviously tune in here or anyone else that's doing it. And you guys can get a good idea of what Madden 17 is all about if you're wondering um in the high tip chart so oh that's another balanced offense so the pie chart is getting near full for balanced offense so basically early in Madden you're gonna have a lot of like random stuff going on your team's gonna look like a mess that happens but our receiving core and running back looks good now we're gonna check the auction house after we complete the Broncos Solos, but I don't think there's gonna be anything here because EA access just dropped this game today, so I'm probably among the first people Who are playing this unless of course like I've said millions of times, you know the big youtubers got early access, but you know 12 subs I'm not a big youtuber yet, so I Didn't get the early access, but it's all right because we're playing it right now. We have 10 hours My goals are to get all these games done which we're gonna very easily and probably all the skills trainer stuff where it teaches you how to pass run and all that Not because I want to do it really, but you get achievements or trophies whatever you're playing on And you get ultimate team players which 75s are gonna help right now when you're a 67 overall So that's a tip guys do your skills trainer because last year you got a hundred gamer score achievement So yeah, do it for achievements and do it for ultimate team players Bang it out when you got time I'd rather play ultimate team obviously, but 
I want to get all the early stuff done before Monday when the game comes out. So when the game comes out on Monday, I can just get right into it. And I can get right into Madden. I don't have to deal with tutorials, skills trainer, all the stuff I don't want to do. It'll be done. Get 20 yards. And they're blitzing. We're going to go to our new guy, Leonard Hankerson. Who caught it? And that ends the solo challenge right there. Now I hope you guys can see how quickly solo challenges are going to go by. All we had to do was hit a 20-yard pass. And we wrecked that. So Garrett Grayson is my quarterback right now. Obviously, that's going to be an upgrade. Later, I'm going to see it at the end of this video if quarterbacks are on the auction house. Like I said, I don't think they will be. But this is no special version of Madden, guys. This is Madden 17. Basically, it installs it into your Xbox, and if you have EA access, like I bought literally just to play this, you will just be able to play it. This is the real thing. All your progress will carry over. And there we go, guys. Mackenzie Bernardo. He is another balanced offense. So nice start to our balanced offense chemistry. Punch it in. Finish the job and punch the ball into the end zone on the ground. All right, we can do that. We can do that. Got a rushing touchdown. We just got a new guard to help us do that. So, honestly, guys, I'm going to tell you right now, get EA access. Basically, for $5 for one month or $30 for a whole year. So it's 50% off, basically, if you buy it for a whole year. You get access to pretty much every EA game like this, where you get your trials. You can play them all before you buy it, which I'm doing with Madden. I love and all older EA games like Madden 16 all the FIFA's all that stuff you can play that for free too and it's 30 bucks for a year I would recommend it I am honestly not gonna keep it though after my month runs out I'm not planning on keeping that I'm doing this literally just for Madden guys but hey I can broadcast it and I can get a head start in ultimate team which if you love Madden Get your head start. It's only $5 and you get a whole month. And you can do what I'm doing now with any game too, which I really like. To try to draw the defense offsides, press RB. Did I just false start myself trying to get the defense? So you tell me to try to get the defense offsides, but it makes my offensive lineman jump. That's real useful, Madden. Were you useful? That's a great... I'm going to try it again. Fuck it. We're just going for it. Hunter Henry, who's back, is open. Cardart is the same from last year's uh, Elite, which I did get. There he is. They actually called him Witten. I played one more game in Madden 16. And they do. They call Hunter Henry Witten. If you don't believe me, get a Hunter Henry card. They call him Witten. Now Grayson. There he is again, Hunter Henry. And I believe we have to get a rushing touchdown. So we're just going to go down right here. I like this Hunter Henry card. The Odell, the Henry, and the Vernon. So the three promo cards, really. Can I run with Odell? What? No. All the promos, we're going to keep with us all year long. We're not really going to be able to use them, though, after a while. I mean, a 77 Oda will probably have its uses, honestly. For a while, a 77 Oda will help. And we have our Hunter Henry as well. Hopefully that card... Hopefully Hunter Henry has a good season and we can get him up. So, I don't know. I thought we were supposed to rush it in. Can I check my objectives? Yes, we can. Rush for a touchdown. Great. That's not going to be easy now. Well, we're going to try it, guys. After the Broncos wave, we're going to check the auction house, see if there's anything in Madden 17 yet. And there's Arian Foster for the rushing touchdown. There we go. And as you can see, now when you end solo challenges with whatever the goal is, your challenge will end, which I like a lot better. So there we go. We have one game left. I'm assuming it's going to be like the Broncos or the uh, Panthers one. So yeah, if you have EA access, you can win a chance to go to Super Bowl 51. So if that's something you're interested in, that's just another reason to get EA access to play Madden early. All right, so we have another opening games pack. 
we've been getting useful stuff, I guess, when it comes to the team as a 67. Oh, okay. That might actually really help me. Yeah, that will really help. As bad as this card is, we're going to use it, and it's going to bring us to a 68. So we'll take that. And the last one, finish on top. The last defensive stand. Keep them from scoring and win the game. That's it. And we're going to be done with current Madden 17 solos. Uh, yeah, we're gonna check the auction house after this see if we can do anything with that And then I'm gonna go and play skills trainer to get ultimate team packs basically you get like One card I think per skills trainer set completed So well, I'm gonna breeze through all the skills trainers and then I'm gonna come back For the pack opening when we got all those so Todd Gurley is a base elite this year at 85 If you don't like spoilers though, and you want to wait, I would not recommend watching this right now if you really don't care There you go, we're gonna be playing Madden uh, I have 10 hours to play this I've probably been playing it for almost an hour now I hate the music so much But maybe I can put like Spotify stuff in this And just listen to my music when I play So Denver has the ball We're up 6 So obviously you know Touchdown they win the game Typical Madden solo challenge Let's do it Paxton Lynch is the starter, Thomas, the even though I think he's number three on their depth chart. Now they'll look to throw it with Lynch. And it's wow. Nice job on defense right there. Okay. So Demarius Thomas, all the guys are in. Throwing here, Lynch on first down. And he'll toss this one incomplete. Seeing no options, he throws it away. Alright, basically we just have to hold the uh, Broncos on defense here and we can win. So I do have my Olivier Vernon, as you saw in the Carolina Panthers video, which is now on YouTube. Um, you get two free cards from your favorite team when you start the game up. I got Odell as my receiver and Vernon as my defensive player. Every team will give you an offensive and defensive player. So that's actually pretty helpful right off the bat of the game. And he drops it. There we go. That's what we needed. Virgil Green with the drop. And they're probably going to go for it. Yep. Let's do it. All we got to do is stop him on 4th and 23, but I'll probably give it up. And there we go. Ball up in the air. As you might have seen, now you can swat the ball, so that's a really good way to prevent aggressive catches now. Instead of just trying to let the aggressive catch happen, you can hit Y to swat the ball away from the aggressive catcher and hopefully break up the pass. Oh, Arian Foster kind of blows, but my line's crap, so. Okay. So, Denver has one more timeout. We're just going to try to run this clock out and finish the Broncos' challenges. Again, I highly recommend getting this. It's $4 or $4.99, really, for a month. And you can play Madden five days early. So, definitely recommend it. Definitely worth it. Hunter Henry, who I got from Madden 16. He's a dynamic addition, which the overall will change throughout this year's Madden season, which is really cool. Is my tight end right now, and I'll probably, well, not probably, I'll always keep him on the team. Because you can't auction him and you can't buy him. Say hike. Hike. Yeah, you suck. Okay, we're going to just snap with A. And there's our win for the Denver Broncos. We're going to go to the auction house after this. So there's not a lot of Madden 17 content on YouTube. I've seen a little bit of people just kind of touring the menus. But this is some gameplay. Hopefully you guys enjoy. And hopefully you guys buy it. Because this is looking like it's a really good game. Obviously it's Madden. You know what you're getting with it. But they've added some things. Kicking is different. But it's really easy each time. Okay, I'm probably not. Actually, I'm probably going to be doing Draft Champions anyway. So... All right, so there we go. 1,700 coins at this stage probably isn't enough to buy anything because I don't know how many people are playing. Ooh, Brian, quick. 
Balanced offense. That's going to complete the pie, as will David Johnson. Promote all five players. Oh, so they've been giving me balanced offense on purpose. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to show you what that pie chart does. Whoa. You guys see all that content? I had to do the opening games first. Look at all that. So we're done. Team challenge. Play your team's full schedule in full games. Oh, Lord. Actually, look at that. It tells you what you get the whole way. 11 packs and items. What are we getting here? 25 contracts. Jeremy Langford. I like this. We're going to do the Giants wave today, too. We're, we're doing a lot of Madden now, guys. We have a gauntlet. Rushing, passing, defense. And we have ultimate season. Play through recap scenarios of 2015 as well as challenges. Let's see what the very... Let's see what the last thing is, guys. You're going to see the final reward. Ultimate season pack. I have a lot of stuff to do now. I'm not... You know what, guys? We're not going to be doing skills trainer today. I'm not going to broadcast all this gameplay stuff, though. Packs, I always will, as I did last year. So, wow. You just have to get through the opening games and you unlock a lot more stuff. That is awesome. So let's put in our new fullback, David Johnson from the Steelers. And our balanced chemistry pie chart is full. And you can see highlight in blue are the players that pie chart affects. And all we're going to do is put in Brian Quick. And that will wrap that up. Where is he? There he is. Substitute inside depth chart. So is there a tier two? There is not a tier two. Once I update this depth chart, guys, I'm going to go. I'm going to play a bunch of solo challenges. And I'll be back to show you guys pack openings. But, actually, well, we'll do the auction house later. I don't want to spend coins yet. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed the first two kind of quick episodes of Madden 17. I'm going to try to see how much solo challenges I can do. Until next time, guys, Dozer03 signing out.